Hey guys, um, Dark Stars here. I'm gonna be doing a little bit of a box opening slash not really a box opening because I've already opened the box. I've already looked at the items, but I wanted to show uh, this new item I got. It well, it was a lot. Um, I got it from Rinkia. Um, I do a lot of my anime goods shopping on Rinkia and from Japan and Mandrake. Uh, for anything that you know. I didn't get a chance to get whenever I was younger, whenever a lot of my favorite fandoms were a little bit more um, popular. But today I just got a couple things from Rinkia. Um, one of which I'm going to be talking about today is a fruits basket lot that I had gotten. Um, <laughs> kind of looking stuff up after the announcement of the new 2009 anime, 2019 anime. Um, I was really compelled to look and see if there was anything on the auction sites that caught my eye. And of course, I found some paraphernalia <laughs> from the new series and the old series that was a that was a really good buy. I ended up paying, I don't even remember. Um, let me look that up. So this lot that I got um, included several items. So as I pull it out, first of all, it included um, this A4 size clear file. It actually included two clear files, one being this one from Fruits Basket Another and this one also from Fruits Basket Another. Um, I haven't actually read any of the new series, but if it's anything like normal Fruits Basket, I'm, I'm definitely gonna be picking up the books. So the items that I got were, I paid, I believe I only paid um, less than $5 for all of this. So that was a great deal. I mean, of course, Rinkia has uh, their, uh, their fees, and all together, I mean, I probably spent about $20 on all of this, which is still a really good deal because this is stuff that they haven't brought over and this is stuff that is not, that is no longer in uh, manufacturing. So good deal for me, at least, I, I believe. Um, so it came with these two clear files. One is a B5, one is an A4, I believe. Um, yeah, B5, because this is a little bit bigger than half of this. So this wouldn't be A5. And that's how you can tell what uh, sizes are, is that B5 is a little bit bigger than the A series and A series. If you cut it in half, this would be A5, this would be A5, and then A4, well, A3, A2, A1, and so on and so forth. Wait, no, sorry. Five, six, seven, eight, so. That's how you can tell how, what everything is. So this is a B5, so B6, B7, B8, so on and so forth. Yep. Yeah. A little bit of education right there if you ever wondered what the size difference is between those. Next, I've got these little booklets. Um, these are actually just like postcard books. They're very cute. It has two, both sets of the cast, volume one and two. Um, all the major characters on one except for Hana, which is kind of weird that they, yeah. Well, Hana and Uo aren't there. That's Kyoko, so, yeah. But it has all the characters in the more, like, more recent style. So, I'm kind of sad that they're not doing the more recent style in the new anime, but I'm still looking forward to it. So, but yeah, these are all little postcards, Kagura. And I love that they include, you know, English translation, you know, so it's not all, uh, it's not all kanji or katakana. But here's the second one. But these are all in great shape. I'm really happy for it being a used lot, I think, so. He's a hero, and then the three. So, very cute, very awesome. 
These, I'm not entirely sure what these are for, but it features the main three from, um, I think, like one of the newer volumes um, that they did to revamp the series and put it in a, um, like, two to three manga in a book. They use one of these images. They use, like, newer art for that. And then from another, they used the same design as from the clear file. I'm really, I'm really looking forward to reading that because seeing some of these pictures, you know, it, it looks really cute. And I've seen a little bit of the manga scanlation, so. Now this is kind of like a real blast from the past. This is uh, a 1999 colorful CD bag. Um, I'm not entirely sure. I'm pretty sure like whenever they did promotional items, they would have promotional bags that went with the CDs, like for the the audio CDs for opening and ending themes. I haven't really opened it. There's actually, oh my gosh, there's three of them. Wow, that's so cool. So front and back, the three of them. Um, then back just Kyo and Toru with uh, Momiji. Then those three together and on the back, Alternatively, Yuki and Toru with Cat the Kyo, with Kyo the Cat, and then Hatsuhari uh, and Shigure. <laughs> I'm excited, sorry. Uh, Hatsuhari and Shigure, and then Yuki and Kyo on the back. So, kind of really cool. I'm really glad that there was actually more than one. I was, I wasn't expecting more, but and I'm was still very happy with getting in the little bag because it has some of the older style art which you know a lot um, from what I understand she wasn't very happy with because of an arm break or something but I'm probably not going to use these but I definitely will keep them sorry things got a lot, of, a lot dark so moving on um next is this bookmark set these have not been removed, so you can definitely tell that these are still um, in original packaging. Uh, it comes with two bookmarks and a couple of collector cards. Um, I'm pretty sure that's Machi and Takeru, Uo and Hana, um, Ritsu and Ren, uh, Kagero, Kagero and uh, Kido, um, their parent. Akito's parents, I can never remember the names because I didn't much care for, yeah. Um, and Kyoko and Toru's father, I forgot his name too, it's so terrible. Last but not least, something I love to collect um, is pencil boards. I do not think I have this one. If I do, I might end up passing it on to somebody probably one of my friends maybe but I've got a couple pencil boards of the fruits basket um collection and I really like this one because it is like I said it's the older style it kind of like a lot of people don't really care for it a lot of people you know especially Takaya's uh Takaya-san but I mean this is what I grew up with. This is this is what I got used to, and this is the kind of weird, lovable fruits basket that you know I grew up with. So, um, but it has all the favorites, all you know, the little boar, harassing Kyo, um, and it doesn't have anything on the back, which is not very common, at least in my experience with uh, Shidajiki where some will have um, an alternate design on the back, some will have information, some will have nothing, but this is a normal B5 size uh, Shijiji, so yeah. So to continue after I was interrupted by the doorbell, I do actually have two other different Shijiji for uh, Fruits Basket, and one of them is actually, the first one I got was in Oh, I think 2006 I bought it and it has the more 
um, up-to-date design. It's a little bit older because I bought it and I had no idea what it was for, but I I kept hold of it for over 10, 12, you know, 12 years now. So I got it in about 2006. I bought it from, uh, no, it wasn't 2006. It was more like 2008, I think. So it's been about 10 years. So there's this one. It has a more, um, like, more recent art style. I mean, you can, if you can call it recent. I mean, it's a little bit closer to this style, whereas less that style. So it's kind of in the middle. It This is, you know, trademarked at 2005. As you can tell, I use it pretty often. I probably should take a little bit better care of it because it is not something that is in circulation anymore. But... I use, I, you know, I used it so much after I found out what it was actually used for. Um, but, and then last but not least, I have this one, which I bought recently from somebody who was getting rid of all of their Shitajiki. Um, I bought like 13 or 14 different boards from them and they had literally everything I wanted. Um, but I also got this one and it has, you know, all the main characters, in the early stages of school uh before the student council thing happened and you know so we've got momiji hatsuharu you know hana uo yuki kyo and toru so and this is you know they i loved how this one and like this one very similar in style they have you know the english translation on it that you know advertises the school this one and this one are very similar like i said you know they have nothing on the back other than slightly transparent this one however it was really cool and i'm glad i got it because it actually has the zodiac with all the different designs um so it was really an interesting little buy because it was just really cute really pink so yeah but a quick overview again. Um, if you want to see my collection of Shidajiki, please comment below and I will go through all of them. I have so many Shidajiki and I love collecting them. So so those were the Shidajiki um, that I have previously. This is the newer one. Here are the two postcard books that I got. The B5 folder and the A4 folder. A4, B5. Here are the bookmarks and the uh, collector cards. And those are just like clear, semi-transparent on the back. And then the three bags. And then this, I guess it's like a promotional card, but it's really cute because I just actually noticed this, but it has Toru and Kyo being romantic on the back. And then, um, I guess her name is Sawa. I don't, don't, sorry. Mina or Sawa, one of those two, because it has it on the one folder that I'm pretty sure it's Sawa. Um, It's this girl. But it has two different sides. I'm not sure. I'll have to translate it and I'll have to look and I'll have to, you know, figure it out later. But I'm really happy with my lot. Again, I only paid $500 for the actual, the actual price of it. Um, and it was such a great deal for everything that I got. And like I said, you know, there's, there's payer, uh, there's, um, fees that I have that go into it and there's you know kind of high shipping because you are shipping it from Japan but I definitely recommend it for anybody who is interested in, in you know collecting older goods that you know are again not in circulation right now and you can always find a really great deal somewhere um definitely give them all a look so but I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, thank you for watching and I hope you have a great day.
like and subscribe and if you have any questions also what are your thoughts on the new 2019 anime um i'm really excited myself and i'd like to hear what you have to say